Glory to God, the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. This is Healing Word with Pastor Igwe, and I would like to welcome you. This is a very sensitive prophetic word. It concerns you and you must act accordingly. You must act according to this word immediately. The Lord says there is a shift. God says there is a shift. The cloud over your head, the cloud over your life is moving and you must respond to that move. You must respond to that shift. Please take a break, like and share the video if you're watching, subscribe if you're joining us new. I'll be so grateful if you can become part of the family. God bless you as you do that. The Lord says there is a shift. Exodus chapter 13 verse 21 tells us that God led the children of Israel by day with a pillar of cloud to show them where to go and by night with the pillar of fire so every time the pillar of cloud moved it was an indication that the children of israel had to change camp but when the pillar of cloud stayed it indicated that they had to make no moves anymore they had to be there when the cloud was there and when the cloud was shifting they had to go along every time the pillar of cloud was moving. The children of Israel never needed to run back to God to ask for a confirmation. Lord, the cloud is moving. Does it mean we should move? No, they already understood that this is the way God shows them which path to take. This is the way God indicates to them that it is time to move. So they never needed another confirmation. They never needed another open prophecy. The Lord has given us an instruction for this season. The Lord has given us an instruction for this month. The instruction says to dare God and to dare great things. The instruction is to dare God and to dare great things. The cloud is moving. We have shifted already. If you do not move when the cloud is moving, you are going to be left behind. You're going to be lost in the move of God. God will be doing things for people and you're wondering why it is not happening in your life. It is because when the cloud moved, you stayed back. This word is coming as an indication to somebody to act according to the instruction that God is giving us this month. There is a shift. The cloud is moving. Dare God and dare great things. If you still have not registered for a Dare God Challenge, you are not yet part of a Dare God Challenge, you are missing out on what God wants to do in your life this season. The cloud has shifted. We are moving already. The instruction says to dare God and to dare great things. It is not late. You can still become part of that challenge. Just send me an email indicating that you want to be part of the dare God challenge. I told us the dare God challenge is simply an indication for you to believe for the impossible. For you to believe in the impossible. What has been considered impossible, what has been considered undone, it is a time for you to believe God for it and to make your sacrifice of faith and then put God to the test. I said every time you obey God's principles, you get the results. God is a God of principles. When you obey his principles, you get the results. The cloud has shifted. You can be part of the move or you can be left behind. When God moves, that is an indication for you to move. When he changes your instruction, it only means that the previous one has run out of its mandate. And now this is the new move. This is the new method that God is using. This is the new move. This is the way God wants to bless you in this season. Please become part of that challenge today. The Dare God Challenge. I'm waiting for your emails. God bless you as you obey this prophetic instruction in the name of Jesus.